Hi, Anne Marie Rogers. I just wanted to address the board regarding this appointment. Um, after working with Mr. Peruzzi for four years on the PRC, I would not recommend appointing him to the ZBA. In my opinion, he does not have the thoughtful temperament necessary to hold a position of this nature. During my experience on the PRC, I have personally witnessed Mr. Peruzzi use obscenities and other vulgarities while seated on the commission, as well as being discourteous, impolite, and terribly disrespectful toward not only other commissioners and township employees, but toward residents as well. His apparent unpredictable and angry nature would not be an appropriate fit for an appointment of this type and importance. Good evening, I'm Joanna Van Rapphorst. Um, we reside at 5900 Southgate Road. It's a cold evening and I know you have a lot on your plate, so I'll be brief. Um, I attended last night's Board of Trustees meeting and normally I let things roll off my shoulders when I hear something egregious, but something I heard last night was so egregious I need to bring it to your attention. I was in the audience and Commissioner Rogers kept glaring at uh, a woman in the audience and uh, when the woman said, please, and this was Ms. Keyes, it, said, please can stop. Tr can we try to discuss issues and not personalities so much? Well, uh, she called a taxpayer and a resident, you're a whore. And normally we're all grown ups here, but that's, that's below the low standards that I've been seeing lately. It's low enough that I've come out on a cold evening to say, I expect and I hope that our park commissioners can uh, display more decorum in the future. It makes people like me who would like to get involved very hesitant if we are in an environment that's hostile and if that is the kind of conduct that we can be exposed to, I, I wouldn't recommend it to anyone. So it's bad enough, I wanted to share that with you. Thank okay. you. Okay, thank you for those comments. I just want you Absolutely. to Absolutely. I am permitted to speak and clarify what happened. She stated that I made a comment to her and that I had been glaring at her, which was untrue. I was looking back at another member of the audience and she actually threatened to take my eyeball out. She threatened me with physical violence on more than one occasion. And that was the unfortunate comment that did fly out of my mouth. So, um, and yes, I did say that, and it was a little bit worse, so. But I just want to make it clear that she did threaten me with physical violence. Okay. So it's a consider the source kind of issue. All right.